Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So ARPCs, as I posted earlier today, will make up 40% of PCs that are sold next year in 2025. Now that video will be in the end screen of this video. But with a Microsoft's push for AR in Windows, there needs to be a hardware component um, available called the Neural Processing Unit NPU for short which is a hardware component that's basically there and designed to boost AR and machine learning and so on um, in AR PCs, which weren't around a couple of years ago. Um, the NPU is really a feature that's starting to roll out of late, and obviously, obviously a lot of the up-and-coming AR PCs are going to have that hardware component. Now, um, if you want a little bit more info regarding NPU, go check that previous video out, which will be in the end screen. Now, just a quick video to show you how you can actually check on your device if your PC has an NPU. So as an example, um, it will be what we are considering to be an ARPC. And it's actually very simple to do. And the irony is we are going to use a legacy component of Windows 11 um, and also Windows 10 if you want to find out if your PC has the AR capability and has an NPU installed. So to do this, it's very simple. We just head to the task manager and we right click on our, um, our taskbar. We head to task manager and you head and click on performance and head to CPU. Now, if you don't have an NPU like I don't on this device, you will see nothing here under GPU. It'll just be a blank field. But if you, if your PC has an NPU, if we just head over to a screenshot provided by Windows Report, yeah, you'll see and find a dedicated entry near the bottom underneath GPU. And yeah, we can just see in this example NPU. And yeah, you can see um, th this is just a quick and easy way to find out if your PC has a NPU a neural processing unit, which basically will um, make it a ARPC um, give or take. So just wanted to put it out there. We have been discussing NPU um, and neural processing units quite a bit on the channel of late due to Microsoft's push um, with AR in future versions of Windows. So I thought this was a good time um, just to show you how you can actually check practically to see if your current device actually supports it. Unfortunately, mine doesn't, but obviously that's a step I'll have to take if and when Microsoft completely moves in that direction then I'll have to upgrade and for the purposes of this channel to get a device obviously that will um, support a neural process and have support with a neural processing unit. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.